Just grab any two. Yeah, just grab any two. So you get one, you go that ring, one, you go this ring, we'll go at the same time. Jack, you go here. All right, so first one, under the ring, two balls, whatever ball's on the right side, you need to go right hand layup, catch it out of the net, and then finish with the other ball with your left hand. Just going for a minute and just alternating all regular mic and count them many, make it a minute. Ready? Go. High finishes, get off the ground, lift your knee. High finishes. Don't miss two in a row. High knees, high knees. Drive up. Pie off the glass. Catch it out of the net. Keep the balls high on your shoulder. Halfway. Now go reverse. Reverse here. Good. Catch and finish. High knee. Same hand, same foot. High off the glass. High knees, high knees, high knees. Quick feet, high knees. Quick feet, high knees. Good. All right. One ball here. So now we're going to go. So you only need one ball, so drop the other one. Don't put it on the baseline because in case it rolls back. Cam will throw me that. All right, so under the ring, you're going one minute, regular mic in, trying to make 30 in a minute, okay? Marty spoke about this on the weekend about finishing higher than what you need to finish because in the one-on-one -on -one situation, we absorb contact and we fall short on our shot. So here, we need to simulate aiming higher than the square. So when you two play one-on-one -on -one later, when you take the hit, it falls out a little bit shorter and it makes it. If you're just aiming for the edge of the, the corner of the square and you get contact, your, short fall, your shot falls short. So higher finishes here, just regular mic and 30 in a minute. Hold up, ready? Go. Quick feet, catch it out of the net, keep it high. Keep it high, extend on the finish. Higher, higher jack above the square. Catch it, catch it. Make 30, here we go, 30. High finishes, high finishes, drive your knee up. Higher jack above the square, kiss it up higher. Good Campbell. There you go, good. Step, drive up. Quick feet as the ball's in the air, move your feet. While the ball's out of your hands, get ready, get underneath the ring. Drive up, knee up. Keep going, 20 seconds here. Jump up, Jack, jump higher, jump higher, good. Knee up, drive your knee up, there you go. Good, Campbell, higher. Freeze. What'd you get, Jack? Count that one. What's that? Good, what'd you get? Good, all right, free throws. Got to make, shoot two. Each free throw you miss is three push-ups. Good. Good, Jack. We got three push-ups, go. I'll go you here. Next one will go uh, reverse. So on this, make sure we don't have our hands out in front, down in our stomach. So as we catch it, we catch it out here. Catch it out of the net. Keep it high, step and finish high. Throwing it back, getting it nice and high on this. You're gonna start to get tight, we're gonna start to shoot short. Get it high. Catch it out of the net, keep your ball above your head. All right, another minute, 30 makes again. Ready, go. Same hand, same foot. Get off the ground, drive your knee up. Good, better Jack. Good Campbell, quick feet. As soon as, it as soon as you let it go, Jack, move. Quick feet, one, two on the step. As the minute gets on, your arms are gonna start to drop. Get your arms up, out, catch it out of the net. Keep them high. Twenty seconds left. 
Good, Campbell, stay with it. Higher. Getting fatigued, finish higher, finish higher. Jump to finish, jump to finish, get off the ground. Athletic finish. Stay with it. Good. What'd you get? 45. What's that? What'd you say, sorry? Oh, 45. 45? Good. All right, two free throws again. That one. Deep breath. Jump. Better, Jack. Good. All right, last one's no backboard. So it's step to the side, all right? And then over the top of the glass here. Over the top of the rim. Don't shoot short, all right? Get it over the back of the ring. Get up nice and high. Get off the ground, drop it in. 30 again in a minute. On this, you've got to move quicker. So the shot goes up. Now you're a bit more outside the rim. So as the ball goes, you've got to get under that ring. So then it's just one nice step and finish. Always got to go from side to side of the charge circle. Ready? Go. Flick your wrist, flick your wrist. Good, Jack. Good. Good, Campbell, good feet, good foot. Quicker feet, Jack, quicker feet. Get to the other side of the ring while the ball's in the air. Get to the other side of the ring. Good, drive it up. Then you gotta get knee higher. Stay with it, stay with it. Don't miss two in a row. On to the next one. Flick your wrist. Get off the ground, get off the ground. Got to get off the ground. Another seven foot is guarding you. Good, Campbell. Drive it, Jack. Drive your knee up. Drive your knee up. Knee, knee, knee. Lift. Good. Jump up. Fuck's sake. Freeze. What'd you get? What'd you get? Good, all right, two free throws. Good. Last one. Going for a minute, you've got all three. You can't do the same one twice in a row. So you've got regular, reverse, no backboard. Have to mix it up. Doesn't have to be all three in a row, you, you decide. But you just can't do the same thing twice in a row. You have to move, as the shot goes up, you're gonna have to move while the ball's in the air. Cause you're gonna go from facing the rim to trying to step through and go reverse. And then you can't go catch and reverse again. So you're gonna have to really move while the ball's in the air. Gotta have quick feet, can't get tired in the mind. Drive your knees. Ready? Go. Still targets 30, count while you're doing this, count. Catch it out of the net, keep high hands, high hands. Stay with it, Jack, stay with it. Drive your knee up, lift that knee up. It's barely getting over your hip. Get up knee height, waist height. Lift your knee. Lift your knee, there you go, lift your knee. There you go, it's much better. Knees, Campbell, knees, Campbell, stay with it, knees. Boy. 10 seconds left, come on, finish it off. Knees, knees, knees. Freeze, what'd you get? 32, and what? Good, all right, two free throws here. Now let's make both these time. Not one of us has made two for two. Oh, you made first one two for two, didn't you? Sorry, my bad. Good, Campbell. Good boy. Job. Job, drink, you make both? Good, quick drink.
Afternoon. All right. Next one we'll go, uh, you can guys both go uh, edge of the key here. All right. I'm gonna spin it out, we wanna catch it above a block. Okay, when we do it. In a sec, you're good. Uh, we wanna catch it above the block so we got room to move on the, on the post catch, all right, in any of our offense. We catch it below the block, it's really hard for us to make a move and go baseline, step out of bounds. All right, if we get pushed off, we wanna try and get a catch above the block. So spin it out high. I'm going to guard one side, all right, I'm gonna push on you. For the first bit, We'll just, it'll be prescribed. So we're gonna go uh, two bounce middle, low and slow, drop step every time, okay? Once we get through all of them, then depending on how I guard you, you decide on what move you're gonna make. Is it drop step on the dribble, on the second dribble, or is it two bounce? You can go two bounce and then drop step, all right? So we wanna go low and slow, so on the catch, I wanna get down nice and wide and low, and this is really, take your time on this. So it's one, really drag the back foot, like over-exaggerate it. Have, pretend there's concrete on your foot, really drag. One two and then on the catch and then it's outside pivot foot and then finish with your outside hand. All right, we'll just go first to three here, okay? All right, let's go. You can go at the same time. I'll just guard one side. Yep, soft sides every time. Good, all right. Now we're going two dribbles low and slow. And we're gonna go on the second dribble, we're gonna go catch, toes facing opposite sideline, and then hook shot, keeping the ball on the outside of our body. Don't catch and land and then face the rim. All right, keep it on the outside of your body. Pretend I'm seven foot, you gotta get over the top, okay? When would you use the hook shot if the guy was, if you're in the post jack? Yeah. Why are you turning middle? How am I guarding you? You're covering the side. Yeah, I'm kind of taking away your baseline side, right? That's right. Okay, we're good with that? Okay, here we go. Sorry, oh, yeah. my fault. Yeah. Good. Yeah, go at the same time. You've got to make shots in traffic. Wait. Yeah, still first to three. Three? All right. Next one. Uh, wait, going blank. We're gonna go spin. So you're gonna spin out to yourself. Fake middle. So shoulder, so catch above the block. Okay, fake middle with your inside shoulder. Yeah. And then it's just quick spin. So you're gonna put all your weight on here yeah. and then use my weight yeah. to then quickly over the top spin. Yeah. Go baseline reverse layup. So we need to alternate on this. Okay, okay you guys watch Power Gasol play a lot. So it's like fake middle, and then he uses all the weight that's pushing him and then spins off him. All right, and then go outside hand finish on the layup. Okay? All right, here we go. Go spin out higher. Spin it up a bit higher, Jack, so you get above the block. When you spin it out, get up high off the floor, yeah? Yeah. Good. You good? Alternate. Alternate sides, yeah? Yeah. Make sure you really exaggerate this. So over exaggerate this with the shoulder in your arm. Three. Yep. All right. Now we're going spin on the catch. We're going reverse pivot. So based on reverse pivot and then just catch it square up and shoot it. When would you just reverse pivot and shoot it? Sorry? When you're playing off you. Yeah. So you're in, the, you're in the post here and then as you reverse pivot and there's still space, just rise up and shoot it. Okay. Go. Three here. Stay low on this, reverse, and then rise straight up in your shot. Straight up into it. So when we reverse, don't, it's on the spin. Don't dip it down, right, and then come back up. It's on the spin, reverse, keep it here, straight, straight up into your shot. Eyes on the target as soon as you spin, not on the floor. Eyes on the rim. Three, all right. Next one's gonna be reverse. 
here. We're gonna go jab step baseline. All right, so rip like you're gonna drive baseline. And then we're going one bounce middle, jump stop, hook shot. Jab step baseline, one bounce middle, hook shot. Good. Outside hand, good, high, high and soft on the finish. Yep. Very good boy. All right. Last one with the reverse. Spin it out, reverse, one bounce baseline, and then finish however you want. You can, if you can get on the rim, lay up, dunk, whatever. So it's just one bounce towards the baseline. All right. I'm gonna go reverse towards the middle now. So baseline foot, reverse towards the middle, straight into our shot here. So baseline foot is moving, yeah? All right, here we go. Three. One. Eyes on the rim straight away, stay low on the spin out. I'll low on the catch. Now nah, reverse, Jack, reverse, reverse middle. Good, Campbell. Three. Reverse, middle. Jab, middle. One bounce baseline. You got a jump shot or floater, whatever you want there. Good. Eyes, eyes on the rim on this. Goes both looking down the floor. Eyes on the target. Three. Three, all right, last one. Reverse, and you got one bounce either way and a, like a baby hook. Okay, one bit, sorry? The same pivot though. Yeah, yeah, so still same pivot, but you, got one, you can go either side on the one bounce. All right, with a baby hook. So it's gonna be quick. One bounce and then rise up, outside hand. So if you go baseline, it'll be your left hand on this side, Jack, and then right hand in the middle, right? All right, here we go. Catch it above the block. Good, that's fine. Good, Jack. Sorry, good. All right, you need a quick drink or you're good to go? You good? All right, one ball here, whoever's got it at the block. Yeah, uh, what, do you can go that one, that's fine. You got a ball? All right, Campbell, you're on D. Split. You're just gonna uh, chest towards halfway, okay? So you're gonna throw it, skip it to me. And then from there, the decision's yours, Jack. Campbell, you're in split because the ball will come to me. You can go high or low. It's not right or wrong. All right, once you take a, once you take a step and Campbell reacts, you need to read how he guards you. So if he denies you from going high, you can go low. If he denies you from going low, you can go high. We want you to get a, the closest catch you can to the rim. I don't want you to just cut and get to the block. If you can seal him on the charge check or deep, great. Okay? So you're aiming to get a catch as close as you can. If it's out here, it's out here. Then from there, you got no more than three dribbles to make a move based on how Campbell guards you. Yeah, if he, if he fronts me in the post pass for it over or not? No, you've got to re, okay, yeah. Yeah, relocate. As it rotating over there? Yeah, I will go winner's keep. Uh, sorry, first to three. O boards is minus one. So you can go into negative. So if he w gets O boards here, you're minus one. We good with that? All right, here we go. Good, one nil. Go again, so Jack's gotta start. My fault, I should have said this. On this, I want you to spin it like someone's thrown it to you in the post. All right, and then as you Chin the ball and chest it. Now you're looking over your inside shoulder and you see I'm open, I'm a shooter on the other side of the floor. So you've got to make this pass direct straight to me. Great outside hand pass. 
Okay, now if you need to pivot while you pass, you can. All right. Yeah, but just don't deflect the pass, but put pressure on it. So about 50%, right? Good. And then you jump off, and then you make a read. Good, be physical. Good. That's my bad. Go again. My fault. Good day. This is an athlete, it'd be a turnover. My fault. Shit passed by me. Good. Block out. Go get it. Go get it. Good. No out of bounds here either. Same thing, Campbell. So you spin it to yourself. So get it when you're ready. So you got a half plane jack, and then as soon as you pass the jump off. Finish it, finish it, keep playing. Good. All right. When you're ready, in stance. What do you want it? What do you want it? Target hands. Keep playing. You good? You alright? Just be more composed. So when we get a catch now, it's like everything's going out the window. We're trying to just beat the shit out of each other. Okay, get the catch. Absorb his energy. If he's pushing you on your right side, then spin and go the opposite way. He can't take away everything. So just two hard dribbles to feel him out, suss him out, and then make a move. All right, you're both as big as each other. All you gotta do is just turn and protect it and go hook, or use your long legs and finish with your other hand, okay? None of you have squared up and tried to play each other. None of you have faced up and tried to go one-on-one -on -one off the dribble, right? Half plane on that, Jack. Play it, play it! That one. Focusing on the finish now. It's alright, you gotta work on it. Stay with it. Stay low, get low, get low, get low. Straight up, Campbell, straight up, Campbell. Good. Finish it. Just like defense, Jack, you wanna stay low. You stand up and you're really easy to push around, especially because he's a bit stronger than you, yeah? Stay lower. Half, half guard him on the pass though. That one. You had him beat on that side. You had him. Good. What are we on? What score is that? What are you on? All right, let's go drink. I feel sorry for him because both of them went through six sessions at the COE on the weekend, so they're a bit exhausted. Let's go, we'll just do this one uh, once. All right, so we're gonna go, we'll go at the same time. We're gonna go three taps with our left hand. All right, on the fourth one, you need to push it over the square, not make a lap, over the top, and then finish it with your right hand. Right. So you don't have to throw that, get in the air and finish it. So it's three taps, push it up, you get, it? Yeah, yeah, tap, like taps against that with your outside hand. I'm not that tall, so you'll be right. Push it over, get underneath, and then get up and finish it with your other hand. We do that once each on both hands. So one here, one there. Yeah. So go left hand first. Left hand taps. Three, three taps on the fourth one over the back ball, over the ring, finish with your other hand. Then three, push it over with your right hand, finish on the left. So just do switch sides. Yes, but make the, let's get it in first. Okay, ready? Go. Go again, Jack, and then, so Jack then just go again till you get it, right? Campbell, Campbell, hold up. Go, actually, let it go, let it go, right? Finger tap, sorry, my fault. Tap, good, tap to finish. You made it, go next one. Go again, you're right. So just relax with it, jump and finish, don't have to be, right? Jump, push it, jump, push, nice, gentle. 
Yeah? Good. Jump and finish. Good. And then on the fourth one, get it over. Good. And then finish. One hand though. Go again. One hand. Control it. Bad luck. Go again. Got to get it. Got to get in the air. Bad luck. Jack, on that when you throw it, you throw it too hard and you're coming out. So get it so where it just falls. When you push it, get it so it just falls. See, so you just got to rise up and tip it in, yeah? Okay. Yeah. And, uh, control it a bit better. Yeah. yeah. Right. Finish it. If you, get, if you get it off the rim, it counts. Now right hand. Three tips on the right, finish with your left. If you can get it off the rim, it counts. Bad luck. Softer, soft tips on this. Get close to the ring, you can get as close as you want. You're pretty tall. Just go, nice soft tip, so one, two, three, and on that last one, yeah? Don't have to bang it so hard. Soft touch, there you go. And the third one, and then get up. Bad luck. So you just gotta be quicker in your full work to finish with the outside hand. Good to get there. Bad luck. Last go each, last go each. Go one more. There you go, did you get yours? Go one more. One more, one more. Softer touches, softer touches. Go a quick drink. So we'll go, um, we'll start in split. So Jack, you can come up. So Campbell, you're there with the ball. Jack, you can start here on this. Yep. All right, so you're gonna throw it to me. You'll be there. Yep, I'll be there. You're screening the def my defender. Yep. All right, and you're going to react. Yep. You've got either roll, yep. slip it. So don't make contact, you get here and s get through. Yep. However, off whatever foot, uh, pop or re-screen. Now, how that's determined is, if Jack calls out show, what would you do offensively? If defense showed, you would what? Uh, slip. Roll. Roll, roll. Yep, good. They called out switch. Slip. Good. If they called out drops. Pop. Good. And if they went under. Roll. Uh, if, the, if my defender goes under, as I come off the on-ball, re-screen. Good, so you would twist it. Yeah. So you're gonna go twist. All right, now. Twist and roll. Yeah, so you're gonna, when he goes under, when he comes under, you've gone from here and you're just gonna turn and rescreen on me. Yeah. All right, and then I'll come off it, we'll pretend the chair's not there, yeah. and then we'll go pop. So I'll attack through here and you can pop or roll, you decide. Pop's out, I'll go pop. You decide with your range. So, so show, switch, under and drop? Good. Just yep, the four. Calling. Yeah, he's calling and you gotta react on it. Yeah. Are you good with that? Yeah. So what's roll? Sorry, what's show? Switch, Slip. under, Reset. yep, good, and drops, Pop. good, all right, here we go. So then after he does this, Jack, then you're in, yeah. okay? Switch. So you call it as if you were guarding him, so you'd probably call it out early, yeah. or not too early, but you'd call it out so your, your teammate would have time to adjust. So you probably need to be calling it 
as Campbell or ja as Jack's getting to this area, he, a call would have been made if you were guarding him, right? Okay, here we go. Under. No, what's under? Defender goes under. Race screen, here we go. Under. Good, forward pivot, good, and then go again. Good. Let's go, uh, first to three on this from now. Ready, go. Drops. Hello. You're giving him all the easy one. Free screen, free screen, free screen. Don't give me an easy one on the last one. Alright, go other side. Neither of you use show. That's all right. No, nah, show as you would roll. Because either when I come off and drag it out, I'll reverse it and we'll go high low action, or we'll go throw back, throw in, or maybe I'll do a really good job and I can get it to you. All right. Go, same thing first. Who won? You go first then, mate. Don't let him go. You want to win one. Yep. Roll to the rim. Drop. Legs finish, concentrate on finish. Under. Free screen. Good twist, no, forward pivot, forward pivot, oh, okay. forward pivot. No, no, stay there. So turn. So when he goes under, right, he's going to go under. So now you have to get underneath him. So forward, oh, yeah. No, yeah, forward pivot. Because he's going under, so then we don't want him to go under again. Yeah? Oh, okay. If I was you, I would have changed it just to mess around with him. Shot Jack. All right, last one would be middle pick and roll, but we'll skip that. Let's go, um, last one here. So you guys start on the charge, uh, sorry, halfway circle. So transition, most of the time it's our fault, coach's fault, especially younger. You guys always just run from rim to block, all right? Where do you want to run to? When you get tired, when habit comes, we just go to the block because it's either strong side or weak side, depending on what your system is for your team. So you need to run rim to rim, get deep as you can on the biggest or lowest guy and seal, all right? So we're just gonna go on zero real quick, a couple of goes, pitch it ahead, sprint, either reverse pivot, either foot, I'm not fussed. You seal the best way you can on the charge circle. I'll throw it to you and you can finish anything with no dribble. So it can be hook, whatever, okay, either hand. Then we'll go one on one out of that with no bounce. All right, here we go. It's on that jack, so be more fluid, right? 
So you just want to go step. So if you're going to go the middle of their middle of their two legs, it's just step, whack, and seal, pivot. All right. So just one movement, smack and pivot. If you go reverse pivot, if you go the, if you go forward pivot. Uh, sorry, if you go forward pivot, too, you can always swim and get over as well. But it's one movement. Okay. If I pass fake it at you now, you've got to come towards the ball. Okay. All right. Here we go. One movement here, one movement. Hands ready. Remember, you got another guy pushing in your back, gotta take a hard pass. Good, Campbell. You going high side? Yep, good. All right. Now let's go one-on-one -on -one here. Jack, throw me that, stay there. So you got uh, at least your toes on the top of the charge circle. Can we go reverse or swim and steal? You got no dribble on the catch. Got to finish. All right, ready? First to three, winners keep. O boards minus one. Ready, go. No basket, travel. Go, you got it. Keep your head over your toes. Don't go too far. Go. Keep going, keep going. Plus one, minus one. You got a dribble on the O board, my fault. After you play. Ready? Go. Stay low. So, oh, sorry. If you get a catch on the block, you can. Okay, that's my fault. So watch your hooking. If you'd made it, I might have given it to you. One more each here. Here we go. Good. You go again. What's that? No, that wasn't that bad. Is that you on one now? Zero. What do you want, Jack? You still on one? Last one to win, uh, to tie it. Free throw.